Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone. Today we are going to find out what is your person's true intentions towards you. This person can be someone you are thinking about or dealing with. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. Alright Scorpio, spirits and angels, please show me. What is Scorpio's person's true intentions towards Scorpio? Show me more. Interesting. So we've got the Five of Swords right next to the Temperance here. I feel like Scorpio, your person may have a little bit of an ego, yeah, but their true intention is to actually fix things with you. With the Temperance here, wanting to reconcile with you, wanting to be at peace with you, but at the same time with the Five of Swords, they are not 100% sure how to go about doing it or whether they should tell you or they're a little bit closed up. I'm getting here with the Four Pentacles. Well, I would say that the intention is to become a better person for you, a better partner for you, because we got the devil here in reverse. If there is a third party, uh, somebody else involved, uh, Scorpio, the intention is to let go of the third party, all right? Only if you're in a third party situation. However, if you're not in a third party situation, the devil in reverse could just be them willing to work on themselves. Um, you know, whatever negativity, something that is negative in regards to them, uh, their personality, or it could be bad habits, could be addiction, could be anything, right? The devil here could be cheating, lying as well. So their intention is to fix that, fix that uh, part of themselves and become better for you because the temperance to me is an angel, right? So become a good person, a good partner for you, treat you fairly because the temperance could also sometimes indicate balance. So you got the five of pentacles here. So it does look like your person misses you, thinks about you a lot, but also the intention is to go through the storm with you, okay? They're willing to work things out with you. The five of swords in this case, you know, right next to the temperance, Temperance is a major kind of, so I would say that uh, I'm going to read the Five of Swords in a more positive connotation than it is negative. Um, and I feel like they're willing to fight uh, for this connection, okay? They're willing to fight for it. They're willing to weather the storm with you with the Five of Pentacles here. And with the Eight of Pentacles in reverse and the Four of Pentacles here in an upright position, I feel like the intention is to continuously holding on to this connection. And, hmm. But the Eight of Pentacles here is in reverse. I feel like, you know, this is something that they don't want to tell you. They are actually working on themselves, but they're not wanting to tell you because Four of Pentacles can indicate them just not wanting to express to you. But deep down, Scorpio, they are really fixing something, okay? They're trying to fix something here. Most likely it has something to do with themselves. And if there's a third party situation, uh, they're thinking about letting go of the third party and come back to you in hopes that both of you could reconcile or get back together with the Temperance card here, okay? So let's see more. So it does look like they're pretty stressed right now with the Nine of Swords and the Seven of Swords in reverse. For some of you, if they were hiding something here in the past, okay, the moon may indicate uh, your person could, could have been hiding something, secrets, but it could also mean fear, insecurities, and with the Eight of Swords here in my first, I feel like they want to release it, okay? If there are any hidden secrets, they want to release it, they want to tell you. Because Eight of Swords in my first can indicate just not wanting to feel stuck anymore and wanting to release oneself from a situation or from anything, alright? But I do sense a release. They are willing to release anything that is unhealthy. Again, I'm just looking at the Devil and the Moon as well. Of course, that's a major kind of so... I would say that Scorpio, they are trying, yeah, they're trying, they're trying to be a good person for you, they're trying to do the right thing, uh, but they could be overthinking with Eight of Swords here in reverse or being very pessimistic, the moon can be quite a pessimistic card as well, so I feel like they could have been dealing with a lot of negative thoughts. Uh, or any negativities in general and I feel like mm, 
the intention is to come out of that, okay, to come out of that and actually to finally want to be, again, I keep seeing they just want to be a good person for you, a good partner for you, to reconcile with you, but they are trying. It doesn't look like it's easy, okay, it doesn't look like it can happen overnight either. So it's going to take some time. And with the Seven of Cups here in my verse and the King of Pentacles here in my verse, Nick, it's a Virgo Capricorn Taurus, you could be dealing with somebody with an Earth sign. It can be any sign, it could be, it could be a Sag, it could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, but I do sense also Scorpio uh, with the Seven of Swords here in reverse. They do really want to be um, transparent with you, okay? They want to be transparent with you. I feel like the intention is to let go of other options if they have other options. Yep, and with the Nine of Swords here and with the King of Pentacles in my verse, I do sense them um, regretful, feeling really regretful over what had happened. Again, they are stressing out, right? And they really want to offer you commitment here, but maybe they have some fear. Again, insecurities, whatever that could have brought on to this connection could have been because of their own insecurities, their own fear. Um, because Five of Swords is a... a um, an energy that I feel like someone who doesn't like to look like they're a loser, they want they don't want to lose, they just want to win because it and you know again I do sense a little bit of an ego here. Sometimes the devil could indicate like ego. Ego is not it depends how you see it, but most times if it can be not good in this situation, that's what I'm seeing here, okay? So with the nine of swords here, Scorpio, the intention is to talk to you, treat you fairly with the justice card here, right? Justice with the, uh, what do you call this <laughs> wing scale here, yeah? Treat you fairly and with the four ones here, gain some uh, stability with you within the connection and with the ten of swords here in reverse, undo the damages that they could have done or, you know, remove the swords off of your back, make you feel better. Um, but definitely, I feel like Scorpio, your person's true intentions towards you is to make peace, be harmonious with each other, treat each other fairly, and uh, they want to treat you fairly and they want to talk to you in regards of that. I do sense them feeling that uh, urgency to talk to you. However, they may have, again, the moon here. They could still be thinking about it, uh, feeling very pessimistic, but they're trying to come out of it, okay? I sense them trying to come out of it. And again, it's not going to be easy for them. Um, they do stress out again because they couldn't give you what you wanted. For some of you, Scorpio, it may not always mean cheating and lying, okay? Uh, just for a small group of you because these pentacles are in reverse here. King of pentacles in reverse, eight of pentacles in reverse, and this five of pentacles is in an upright, which is not the best card with it being in an upright position when it comes to finances. So I would say for some of you, it could have been caused by lack of stability because of financial issues, okay? Um, but for some of you, it could be because of lack of res uh, lack of commitment. Uh, so just take what resonates with you. Okay, Scorpio, I'm reading for a lot of you. So, but I do see two different scenarios here. But anyway, Scorpio, this is your reading. Hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with a video video on the screen right now. This is a video from my second vlog channel. If you're interested to check it out, and also I'm open for... Uh, personal readings if you guys would like to book me my information is in the description box below and Scorpio I post your videos almost every single day however not the same at the, not at the same time all right so if you guys if you guys would like to be notified every time when I post your videos don't forget to hit on the bell notification button all right take care Scorpio bye